Karnataka's top 20 engineering colleges list. We have the top most college which is RVC College, right? So the highest package which was offered this year was 92 LPA. Kind of huge. Average package came around 10 LPA and IRF uh, college ranking. It came out to be 96 for the year 2023 which is again something really good, right? Stay tuned, we'll cover everything. Hello children, how are you all? I hope that you are doing extremely good. So yes, we discuss about how to choose a college, how to choose a course and today we are back again with Karnataka's top 20 engineering colleges list. We thought we could simplify things for you even now. So over here we have the top most college which is RVC college right here in Bangalore. And in this video, if you see this video, you'll get an idea about the placement rates, about the seat matrix, about the fee structure, about the hostel facilities, lot of things. So stay tuned, we'll cover everything. And I know that you are looking over here, which is again something which is very much important, right? So the highest package which was offered this year was 92 LPA kind of huge average package came around 10 LPA so you can be rest assured that if you get into this college probably you'll get around 10 LPA for sure then if you talk about the placement rate this is something that we have calculated we'll show you everything about it but it came out to be 73.3 which means if uh, if there's a class of 100 children then probably 73 of them got placed which is actually really good right so we'll get to know more information about the same but slowly okay so over here we have a perfect overview of the college what is the name of the college it is rv college of engineering year of establishment is 1963 kind of very old but very famous even now right so where is the location it is located in bangalore so number bangalore people all be happy because we are talking about your college now it is affiliated to Vishweshwaraya Technological University which is again a very good university. What is this information useful for? So for example you are going ahead of, uh, to find uh, the seat metrics. How can you find the seat metrics? You can put the name of the college in that list in the control find uh, zone and you can find the list of the seat metrics and everything very easily right. So which is why we put this particular column down over here. Now next thing what do we have? We have the alumni, the prestigious alumni who passed out from this particular college. You might be very well aware of Mr. Anil Kumle sir. He was the former captain, the coach, the commentator and he was known to be the biggest spinner in his era. Right. So over here we have uh, Sir Gurudat S. Baravar, the VP of Cognitive Computing at IBM Research. So IBM Research is a group of uh, uh, people who are coming together uh, like scientists, designers, everyone working on computational technologies, right? And over here we have Sir Ashok Nayak who is the chairman of Hindustan Aeronautics Limited. Well, you know them. They are the one who create aircrafts for us. They, they manufacture the aircrafts for us. So obviously big salute to them, right? Now we have Sir Vishwesh Mudagal, he is the CEO and co-founder of Good Work Labs. Again, if you are not aware about Good Work Lab, I will tell you, it is a software and app developing company and it is world's, uh, what say, a leading company of software and app development. Something again, very big. So one day I hope among this list of people who are over here, very prestigious people, I find you as well. Lot of you, right? So that we don't even find a place to fit you guys in. Next thing. We have the placement record which is, as I said, something of very much importance. Over here, we have the highest CTC which was offered this year, that is 2024. What was it? It was 92 LPA or 92 lakhs. Next thing, average CTC, it came out to be 10 lakhs. So you can be happy about that as well. Number of companies uh, that visited uh, this particular college, it was 238 number of companies which is again a very good number number of offers made in the year 2024 is 778 again something really good the placement rate came out to be 73.3 but this is not from their official website from their official website we could find these data but not this so we came up came up with a solution because we also wanted to present you with the placement rate as it could help you decide what you need to do right should you choose this college or not so we thought we'll make it easy for you and we have come up with a what say a formula 
we put the total number of offers and then we divided with total number of seats which were there allocated already and we multiplied it with 100 we got the placement rate but but there is uh, nothing hidden from you i am very honestly telling this you this is something that uh, we deduced so obviously this placement rate will be the approximate placement rate once they are updating things obviously we will update it to you as well right so we go ahead so 778 divided by 1060 into 100 we got 73.3 which is the approximate placement rate that is something really good we go ahead to find out what are the number of companies visited the number of offers made and the CTC so over here almost 70 companies visited and they gave 14 lakhs and above and what were the offer, offers made it was 253 that is something really good so in an average as I said it is 10 LPA but above that also a lot of children might have got which is again a piece of great news so this is the criteria on basis of which you can choose your college because obviously everyone wants a job right yes now we go ahead we see the branch wise offers made in the year 2023 again we didn't get 2024 data but but we wanted to show you general idea of things so over here you have so many branches and uh, over here we have CSE which is topping the list right CSE stands for computer science and engineering and over here the number of offers that were made was 210 which is something really nice so if you're looking forward to CSE if this is your favorite subject then I'll say go for it because obviously they are bagging a lot of uh, what say offers here now if you go ahead we have electronics and communication engineering also with 171 offers and if you go ahead we have mechanical engineering with again 108 offers again something that is really good and something to be happy for as well so you got a basic idea so I think if I was going to this college I had pretty good rank then probably I'll be going for CSE if I'm interested in that particular field so if not then probably EC well number of offers made and the what say amount received is also very important the what say the payment received is also very important okay so generally check that in the website as well so they might be putting certain children's pictures in there saying that they got placed so see which branch do they belong to which is also very important okay now we go ahead we talk about the ranking so there is a department for ranking okay a body a organization for ranking which is national institutional ranking framework is there and according to it NIRF uh, college ranking it came out to be 96 for the year 2023 which is again something really good right over here we have university ranking so you saw that this particular college is affiliated to Vishweshwaraya uh, Technological University so basically they have got 63 rank again that is something good so on what parameter do they decide this particular rank well children um, it depends on the faculties who are there over there do they have PhD how much experience they have and now it depends upon the uh, what say articles being published uh, the resources being provided to children and the number of alumni uh, where are they allocated to are did they get good jobs or not everything comes under this okay so there are a lot of parameters which decides the NIRF ranking system so over here we have 96 which is pretty good okay now we go ahead what do we have the mode of admission ma'am I want to get into this college how can I get admission children there are two ways one is case said other one is what come with K. either way you can get into the college well if you get in the college through case said obviously the what say uh, the fee will be comparatively lesser so I hope that is also clear and case it is for Karnataka students so basically who are there in Karnataka it's for them whereas a comet K others can also apply now we go ahead we see the fees something very important because we have to spend money to study right so we have case it fee a tentative of them which is uh, now being published right in their uh, KEA website so from there we got this data that the case it fee could be rupees 1 lakh what's say 7495 now i've put an asterisk sign over here why because this could change this is a provisional fee okay this could change definitely change we never know so comet k fee 
that is there from their college website only which is why i put it right here right so it came out to be rupees 2,81,477 now children who are confused about the fees about the case it fees you have to be happy because we have come up with another video uh, about the provisional fee structure about what did Karnataka government give regarding the same so you can check this video and have better clarity about the same right we go ahead i hope this is clear we go ahead we see what all courses are offered so this is where children all of them they come they pay their attention right because uh, this is something that could change their lives forever so over here we have uh, different courses starting from aerospace engineering and not ending at uh, electronics and communication engineering it goes ahead to what mechanical engineering so it goes up to this list now over here if you see i have made four columns this is a list of courses and here we have seats the number of seats so number of seats as in for aerospace engineering if i say 60 seats are there that means only 60 children can get into this college for this particular course okay that is what i mean by number of seats we go ahead we talk about the cutoff for k set well this cutoff range is for 2023 because we we didn't get to the to talk, che, we didn't get the 2024 list so it happens slip of tongue happens right when we are talking like this blah 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 <laughs> so do not mind that i'm really sorry so over here we have cut off k set 2023 we have this many numbers so what do we mean by this basically for example you want to get into computer science and engineering course and the cutoff range is 360 okay that is it and what is your rank it is 200 so obviously 200 comes below 360 so you can get in this particular course but if my rank is 400 okay and i have given case it exam can i get into this college no if my rank is five uh, this course no this course not college this course if my rank is 500 can i no you has to be below 360 that is what we mean by the cutoff range over over here we have a comet k as well comet k if you see the same thing happens over there now the major part of the whole story is the highest cutoff and the lowest cutoff the highest cutoff for k set it was for computer science and engineering and as you see over here we have what 360 as the as the highest cutoff now what was the lowest cutoff lowest cutoff is somewhere over here let's see that you see it here it's for industrial engineering and management the cutoff went up to 21189 so i say the highest cutoff is 360 whereas when you talk about the lowest cutoff it went up to 21189 so same thing for comet k as well if you see comet k what is there over here we see the cutoff range the highest one is for computer science and engineering again 406 what is the lowest one it is for civil engineering that is 17203 now children if you still want to get into this college but you it's uh, it's not a sure thing what course you want to get into okay but you just want to get in this college because it's your favorite it's matching all the parameters what do you do you see the cutoff range so the highest cutoff range is what 360 and the lowest is what two uh, 21189 if your rank comes in between this then probably you can get into any course of your wish over here which matches your rank okay so for example my rank is around 4500 so probably i can get into this particular course that you are seeing over here that is electronics and telecommunication engineering or anywhere else if i see uh, some other college which has uh, other course which has the same rank i can get into that particular course as well okay so my if my rank is this much then probably 4500 then probably i can get get in for electronics and telecommunication engineering now we go ahead what do we have comet k comet k again the range is specific we have from 406 to 17203 if my rank comes in between then probably i can get in for any course where my rank belongs okay so it's that easy so the cutoff rank has to become has to come so when it comes we'll surely update you that as well okay for 2024 i hope this is also clear to you 
now we go ahead we talk about the facilities provided so college is not just about studying but also having fun right so the fun starts at hostel that's what i believe so here you do have hostel facilities for both boys and girls and if you talk about transportation services it is also there so time to be happy we go ahead we ask you about something very important are you finding it difficult to find all the important information about your dream college even now so you can still comment down all these queries that you have because we are here to help you if you ask us a doubt then we will definitely definitely clear that doubt and give it to you that's our promise okay so what do you need to do you need to comment them down and we will clear it up apart from that if you think that this particular video was very useful for you everything what i said is understandable do not forget to like share and subscribe because that's how we all grow right and over here you have sets of uh, what's a videos which will be really important for you to have a clear understanding about k set so you can definitely watch these videos um probably they will be giving you all the links to this video so that it becomes really easy for you okay so that's all about it if you like the video do not forget to like share and subscribe and do not forget to smile as always bye bye take care